Hey, hey everyone, Merry Christmas. Hope you've all had a great one and or having a great one. Just thought I'd uh, put out a quick Christmas video just to, so, just to say that, Merry Christmas. I hope you all have a fantastic, fantastic holiday period and uh, look forward to uh, bringing in the new year in just a week's time. So um, yeah, just thought I'd share with you what I got for Christmas. My lovely wife was able to hook me up big time as always and uh, got some really cool stuff. So. First off, she get me a new pair of thongs, which is a flip-flop for you folks in the US. So it's a pair of those, and they're awesome. <laughs> they are being worn once I put them back on the floor. <laughs> but they're awesome. I was, uh, I've had my Baby Yoda ones for about a year, and they are sort of a cheaper one, but um, they will they will last another another 12 months, so that's that's always good. Plus, it's, it's summertime now, so it's it's perfect, perfect for it. <clears throat> the other thing she got me was this little little Grogu mug, which is awesome. Into the little frogs piled up there on the side. Got a little frog in his mouth, <laughs> super adorable. Definitely not going to be using it because uh, it belongs in a museum. This museum in here belongs in here. And that's where it will stay. So I think it's it I think it's awesome. Love it. So cool. <laughs> I really like it. Now i would never even seen it, so it's a cool little surprise for me. So that's awesome. <clears throat> uh, my father-in-law actually got me this little dealio. It's a little um let's we can get it to work. There we go. And change colours, little LED lamp, which will just sit on a shelf, it'll look cool. Nice little bit of background lighting. And it changes colours, there's one there, it just sort of goes through all the colours. There we go, sort of blinks. So that's kind of cool, I like that. There's these cool little gimmicky gifts that you get. I, I like it, I think, it's, I think it looks great. So um, yeah, looks like a little hologram. Turn that one off. So that's cool. Um, the other thing I got from my wife, is Death Star cookie jar. This thing is awesome. I saw this at Big W down here in Australia um, just before, like, probably a month before Christmas, and I thought, oh, that'd be cool. I don't know what I'm gonna do with it. I'm not gonna keep cookies in it. <laughs> um, I do actually just have like Cadbury favorites in there at the moment, so. That's cool. I love this thing. I think it looks awesome. There was a um, Mandalorian helmet that just came out as well. So, but I think the Death Star, you could have a Death Star cookie jar. It's old school. It's awesome. Um, and yeah, I'll keep some bits and pieces from my collection in there for when I need them. So it's, it's always a cool thing. I do have a BB-8 one from a few years ago. So that's cool. Dig the Death Star. And uh, yeah, lastly, she uh, couldn't find these before my birthday back in November, and I'd asked for them. Um, I've fallen a little bit behind in my on my reading, on my comic reading, so she's able to, been able to find me a few of the comics I'm after. Um, I still am so far behind now. Um, pretty much most of this year's stuff, all the stuff that's sort of happening post Empire Strikes Back, um, I haven't seen yet. So High Republic, Volume One. I haven't read the uh, haven't read the comic series yet. I bought all the issues, um, bought all the singles. I think I maybe maybe missed the last one, uh, issue six or five. I can't remember. But yeah, looking forward to looking forward to digging into this one. I'm just finishing off um, one of the High Republic books now. It's taken me a long time to read, um, just from lack of time basically, and uh, probably sitting on my phone too much. Uh, Star Wars Volume 1, so I think there are two or three volumes out at this point. So looking forward to jumping back into that and seeing what's going on post Empire Strikes Back. That should be pretty cool. Some great looking artwork in there. And then Charles Soule is involved with that, which is great. Uh, next one I got was Bounty Hunters. Galaxy's Deadliest. 
So we get introduced to, well, we have been introduced to him before at this point, but that's our Valance. On the back, never betray a bounty hunter, even if it's Boba Fett. Especially if it's Boba Fett. So that, that's looking cool. Love that artwork. It's looking awesome. Got Bosk and Boba on the front. Like a black series of uh, Valance. That'll be a cool looking figure. And then I've got Volume 2 of Bounty Hunters. Target Valance. 4 LOM and Zuckus on the front. That's awesome. So I'm looking forward to reading this series. And then uh, jumping into the War of the Bounty Hunters, which is sort of the big sort of crossover event that's recently happened in the comics. So I will catch up at some point. I just need to get a hold of the books and uh, really just sort of spend some time reading, just getting into it. Because, um, yeah, up until probably 12 months ago, I was completely up to date. And then I just sort of let it slip this year. So um, I will catch up. It's just been, yeah, <laughs> need need to dedicate a little bit more time to the, to the books. Um, but yeah, that's it. I've got a few things in the mail coming. Um, well, one thing at least that I know of. Um, so hoping that gets here. I was hoping it'd be here like a week ago, but it's, you know, postage at the moment is crazy. And uh, yeah, the world's very crazy at the moment. So um, still no sign of no sign of us settling down just yet. So hopefully 22, 22 things will start to pick up for everyone. Um, Cause yeah, it has been a challenging couple of years. And uh, yeah, again, I wish you all the very best. Stay safe. Spend, hope you spend some time with your loved ones. And uh, we'll see you all very soon. I'm putting together some plans for what I'm going to do in terms of Book of Boba Fett, possibly doing a live after show. So that will probably relate, re replace the live live stream on weekends for a few weeks until we get through Book of Boba Fett. Um, really, really looking forward to being able to sit down and talk to people straight after the episode. So as soon as... As soon as I organize that, I'll put times up on my social media and uh, make sure there's things to go around and hopefully you can get a guest on every week. That'd be fantastic to, to break it all down with me. So look for, looking forward to that. So yeah, Merry Christmas, everyone. And uh, we'll see you very, very soon. May the force be with you always.